Hello and welcome to the simply lovely Range Rover uh, Evoque. Uh, I'll start this near side front corner or off side front corner and I'll walk you around it. First thing I notice we've got parking sensors and what I think are um, the cameras to the front of the car. It was subject to a private plate transfer. Uh, that has been done. I think we are in possession of the V5. Coming around the side of it, tyres are in good order as you can see. A uh, wheel however does need a wheel refurb there just on the edge. Panning down the side of the car, I'm stood what a couple of metres away, there's no obvious as to rash marks, trolley dings or anything. The only thing I can see from a distance is that bit of muck, that'll come off. So what a nice car. Rear wheel, again just a little bit of kerbing but the tyre as you can see is in great order. We don't guarantee tyres as you'll know by now, however I do give you an indication whether they're bald or not. Um, coming around the back of the car as you can see it's an SI4. It's a lovely spec, it's got my favourite seats in this car. Uh, reversing camera, that's what I'm just pointing out, I'll just dive in the boot. There we go, I wanted to see if it was a power boot. It's a well spec car, this got DAB TV uh, and everything. Uh, so it's got an oil top up kit there and then the compressor is all there and the all important locking wheel kit, not key, which is what I was secretly looking for. Curry hooks in the back, always a favourite of mine. There we go. So little mark just on the plastic there, that'll polish out no problem. And then this wheel, I think he's, managed, he's one that managed not to curb. And the tyre again is in great order. On this side there are a few little marks, one there, that'll polish out. And a couple just here, again they haven't broke the paint, so they'll just polish out for you. Coming down again, the offside. Just like the near side really, nothing to write home about, no obvious scratches or dents. I know you're dying to know so I'll let you into the secret now, it has got the glass roof. And again all four tyres are in great order. So there will be a few stone chips on the front, badge has gone a little bit milky, but too much TFR has been used on that so you might uh, replace that or just get uh, one of the guys just to repaint it. Here we go, so onto the inside of the vehicle, so we've got uh, driver memory package and passenger memory pack, full electric seats, just turn that sound off, we've got the Meridian Hi-Fi, we have the full leather dash, we've got the um, twin screen sat nav, so we have the, so you can watch the TV in the front as well as the driver, uh, as the driver goes along, and these are my favourite seats. No matter what car I get in, in, these are, they look great and they're really comfortable. Heated as well, so let's get everything we want. I have got two keys for this car, taking us to the service history. So it has been serviced uh, all the way through. Main agent, so done at 20, done at 34, done at 51, done at 68, which is his last one in uh, November of 14. So it's due a service, bear that in mind. Uh, one key with it, the other key is inside, I have seen it, and we've got the full complement of handbooks. So over to the instrument cluster, just like that focus, it's done 96,370 miles. As I said, we've got the TV Unacceptable function, a bit of CBeebies there for you. You can see that all working, it's a twin screen set up so when you drive away this turns off that's what you have those earphones for we the storm is too and we turn... we've got heated seats uh, driver and passenger um, dual zone air conditioning all standard this the all important panoramic roof so what a really really well spec car this is you don't see many of this higher mileage it's a three door so more popular better looking car uh, multifunctional steering wheel all good stuff so as we always do, winning bidder, please feel free to download the photos. They're yours, get them on your website and you'll have that retailed quick as a flash. Thanks for watching, bye bye.